Hello everybody, I started a new project and this is uh, black cotton. I painted it with acrylic paint. Um, it's um, something I found on Pinterest. I like the, yeah, the three cats. And I'm now going to quilt it. I'm just letting you see how I do this. The camera I'm, I've got in front of me. It's, uh, I don't know if it's handy to do it like this, but I'll try. Normally I set my camera on that side of my work, but you have to see sometimes for yourself. So I'm starting. I've got an open toe uh, embroidery foot, and I'm using um, Smetch um, Step Needle Quilting. It's really, um, I think it's better because if I uh, take the normal needles, the 80 for sewing then the thread is quickly broken that's why I'm using this one so that's a tip for everybody who's I know I think everybody who quilts for a few years knows it but the new under us the new quilters that's something you have to know what did I also do of I I batted it and on the back side I've got uh, black material as well. I've got the needle down position. It's always handy. Oh, I'm sorry. Let me see. I got my stitch on two and a half. I'm going down to two point two point two. To watch it with the camera. I hope you can see what I'm doing. So if the line is a little bit thin, I just uh, painted it, uh, I'm going to paint it with black thread. So I smudged a little bit with paint on this piece, so I just fill it in with black paint, uh, black, black and thread, sorry. Turn the quilt because it's pushing. So just I show it to you. Just roll it up, see. And this is what I I got the stitching plate, uh, just straight stitch, and uh, it's locked in. You see that here. Then I can't. Um, Put something else on it. Yep. Okay. I think it's going well like this. So 
So here I forgot. I just painted it too close. So I'm just going to make it black again with thread. And you can do it. Let you see how. So this is the tail and I just rounded it up a little bit with the stitching. See, this is now a little bit wider and black. I think that's, yeah, that makes it just even nicer. And this is also this part here. So I'm going to go further and stitch even more and I make I'll come back when I'm a little bit further. This is the part I just wanted to show you how I do it. Take out the needle first. Hope the camera's put it a little bit backward. My knee lifter has to go. Okay. A spiral. See that? If I just smudge a little bit with the paint, I just go over it. Ladies and gentlemen, if you just go a little bit over the painting or inside or outside, it doesn't have to be perfect. Look at this one. This is also not perfect. But if you if you see the painting in its whole thing or the quilt, it won't matter. Nobody will say, oh, that's ugly. It's thread sketching, so... So if I go to another one, I'll foot up, needle up, see if I can manage this, hold the thread, put the needle down, just 
just to get the thread out of the way. So go, go back on the spiral. Let me see. I have to watch it because I... Sometimes I I went this way and sometimes I went that way. And if you're not sure how to do these, I got a oh, let me see where is it? I just drew it with this stuff on it and you can easily go over with the iron and it irons away. It's um it's a waxy waxy yeah pot the orders at drawing it's wax and you can easily get it off with the iron heating it up so what i just have to do is these these see what i drew and that way so you don't you can do it uh if you're good at it but i'm not that good at it so that's why i did it like this I'm almost finished. I'm thinking about using these two colors. This is a silky, um, this is from, let me see, well, oh, this is Metla and this is Guterman. This is a silky one, embroidery thread, and this also. I'm thinking about doing something here, down here, quilting it on, thread sketching. See how it goes. So I've finished all the round bubbles up here, and the cats as well. It's a great job. It's maybe an hour and then you're finished with quilting and thread sketching. So this is the part what I'm going to do now. Get the thread on and start. So this is the last little piece. I clip myself. I love these scissors. They're very sharp, so I thought, clip the thread, and I clip my finger. Well, accidents happen with sewing. Take out my bobbing thread. What's this? Oh. Use my knee lift. I'm a little bit wobbly because I've got the camera in front.
to let you see what I've done. Oh wait, it's still attached. Sorry. Yeah. Still have to get some threads out of the way. Yeah, I like it. Oh, well, what do you reckon? Do I quilt this bit here above? I don't know. St still thinking. Shall I or shall I? Or won't I? Yeah, it's, I think this is the nicer colour, the green. Because if you do it with black, it's, I don't know. I think it's just too much black then. Yeah, the kitty cats. Okay, this is my work. I think I'll leave it like this. Still have to um, um, do a selvage on it. Quilting edge. Ah, binding. I, I, I mean binding, you know, my... My English is not that that good. I'm thinking Dutch and I have to have to translate it in English, that's why. Well, I hope you liked it. I'm glad. So I will say see you the next time. Bye bye.